Taking screenshots on an Android smartphone is easy, but what if the content you want to screenshot is stretched vertically? Here's where a scrolling screenshot comes in handy. It allows you to capture vertically stretched long pages in one single screenshot. So follow along as I explain three ways to capture scrolling screenshots on an Android smartphone. Method 1: Using an inbuilt screenshot tool on Android. The ability to take scrolling screenshots is enabled by default on most Android phones. To use it, first open the long web page or document you want to take a screenshot of. Use the usual power plus volume down button combination to capture a screenshot. You should see an option called scroll capture next to the preview. Just tap on it to start taking a scrolling screenshot. You'll see the content on your screen will start scrolling down automatically. Once you have reached the desired point, touch the screen to stop capturing. That's it. You can now edit and save the image in your gallery. Method 2: Taking scrolling screenshots on Google Chrome. Google Chrome on Android now comes with a built-in scrolling screenshot feature. Let's see how you can use it. On the Google Chrome browser, open the web page you want to capture. Once you are there, select the three dot and tap the share button. In the pop-up window, you should see an option called long screenshot. Now you need to manually select the portion of the web page you want in the screenshot. Next, simply tap the tick mark. You can see preview of the screenshot along with the options at the bottom to let you edit the image. Finally, you can save the screenshot to your device or share it with others. Method 3: Using a third-party app. In case your Android phone doesn't give you the option of taking scrolling screenshots, then you can use a third-party app. The Google Play Store has a ton of apps that lets you capture a scrolling screenshot. I recommend checking out the Screen Master app which comes with a host of features including the ability to take scrolling screenshots. So, install the Screen Master app and open it. You need to enable the auto scroll screenshot option. Grant accessibility permission. Next, tap on auto scroll mode. Here, you can select the semi auto scroll option. The full auto scroll option is not available in free version of this app. I have purchased the premium version of the app which cost me around $5 for a lifetime license. However, you can stick to the free version as the semi auto scroll option will work just fine for most users. Just tap the large green button and enable display over other apps. You should see a floating screen capture button on the display. Now, go to the apps or screen on which you want to take a scrolling screenshot. Then, tap on the floating button to start the process. At first, the app will capture a screenshot. Here, you need to select the stitch option at the bottom. Then press the plus button to start capturing the next part of the page. You can see the new screenshot is added to the carousel at the top. Hit the plus button repeatedly until you have covered the area on the screen you want to capture. Once you have snapped all the screenshots you need, tap the check mark option. On the next screen, tap auto stitch to stitch the screenshots automatically. Finally, tap the save button to save the screenshot to your gallery. There is also a pen icon in the top right corner. Tapping it will take you to the edit screen where you can edit or annotate the screenshot.